Bawam, all praise, the honor, and glory, Yahweh, Shemashai, double honors to the apostles and the elders, a great millstone, and peace and blessing to the Akim out there, were pushing this word in true sincerity. All right, your brother cannot. And you damn devils are through, man. All right, so this video, this lesson that I wanted to do was inspired by the brother uh, Kwanau Wa in the camp. You know, and it's been on my mind, too, about pretty much how he was going into the opioid epidemic. You know, and, and certain brothers, especially of this camp, have, have done many pieces on the opioid e epidemic because... This is one of the um, this is one of the, the big the big uh, places where opioids are, are being abused, and we see it. We literally see these opioid uh, these heroin addicts shoot up like we actually see it like with our own eyes. You know, when we, every time we go to camp. So this is really a, a big hit in the Esau's community. Now I don't want to go necessarily on the opioid epidemic, but that just I just want to go into uh, pretty much these, these curses being uh lifted up off of us off of our nation okay starting with the elect and now these curses are being placed upon upon uh the so-called white man okay because if when you come up and do when you come up in um deuteronomy the 20th chapter now let me get that all right so this this is deuteronomy 28 1 and this was given unto israel israel was given the laws okay so this is deuteronomy 28 1 and it shall come to pass if thou shalt hearken diligently unto the Lord thy power to observe and do all his commandments, which I command thee this day, that the Lord thy power will set thee on high above all nations upon the earth. So that was a uh, that was a covenant and a promise given unto the nation of Israel. Now the so-called white man, he has taken upon the Bible upon himself, and he called himself the people of the Bible. So by you doing that, you have to follow all the things in the Bible. And if you don't, a curse will become unto you. Okay, this a it's that it's, that, it's like a, you know they have them old Egyptian tales. Well, if you go into the, the pyramid, if you steal, there's a curse that be placed upon you, or if you read a certain book that a, that a curse placed is is placed upon you. Well, it goes to the same thing. That's the concept of the scriptures. That's the concept of, of following the law, statutes, and commandments that are real that are written in the book, and then you observing and doing them, and the Lord He's going to bless you. So from from verse two. The verse 14 is talks about the blessings that you shall receive if you do these commandments. And then from uh, 15 with 16 all the way to 68 talks about the curses that you are going to receive. If you if you said, OK, I'm going to do all these things and you don't do them. OK, so this is Deuteronomy 30, uh, 30 and 7. And the Lord, thy power will put all these curses upon thy enemies and on them that hate thee, which persecute thee. And starting our lead enemy is you so-called white people. Okay, the Lord, he has given us up to your hand. And look what you have done. You have destroyed us as a nation. You have put drugs into our communities. Okay, you have put guns into our community. You you have, you have uh, participating in destroying our nation. Okay, you, uh, you, you, you put our women in front of us. Okay, now our whole family structure is totally destroyed. You have, you have given free reign to uh, our kids to be uh, 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 pretty much enemies of the Most High, to worship other gods. Okay, you beat our nationality out of us. You told us that we're Africans. Okay, you told us that we are from a different nation. You told us that God hates us, that we're ugly, that we're cursed. Okay, that we're nothing, we're just, we're just thugs. Okay, and then you have tried to uh, pretty much uh, exterminate us from off the planet of the earth. And you have been a perpetual enemy Okay, ever since the inception of Israel. Okay, this is going. This goes all the way back to the beginning. Okay, with Cain and Abel. Okay, with Jacob and Esau. Okay, you have all always hated us, and 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 you have showed you have uh, pretty much blatantly showed forth that hate. All right, you wore it on your sleeves, especially during the time of slavery. Okay, and now you're starting to do it more and more now because of Trump. Now you have you have done all these things by. Uh, by giving us guns, by giving us drugs, by giving us this uh, this Babylonian juice, by making us drink it, by making us drink that cup of slavery, okay, and then demoralizing us as a as a people, okay. Now all the curses that are placed, and that was a curse unto us that the Lord He was going to send forth a, another nation from far, a tongue that we did not know, and He and they were going to oppress us and put us in captivity. Our women are going to get taken away from us. Our children were going to get taken away away from us. Are you you raped them? Are you you slaughtered them? Are you have given them to uh, the wild beasts and animals? You pretty much have sport with our nation, okay? With our women, with our children, with our men, okay? You you took our goodly things. You are you destroyed our language, okay? 
You have done all these things to us. And then you oppress us in this society. You oppress us in America. You won't allow us to get uh, you won't allow us to become equals with you, which we don't want to be equals with you. I'm just giving you an example. The things that you have done, you always keep us under you because you feel that you're the head nation. OK, you poison our na you poison our 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 our, uh, our our neighborhoods Are you set it up to where we can't get loans. You set it up that we can't have the best education. You set it up to where we have to eat the, the, the uh, all the, the bad food and the bad the bad wine and drink. OK, you give us this tech. You give us this technology that destroys us. OK, you give us this uh, this uh, your 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 programming on these different TVs that 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 destroy our, our, our people's mind, especially our women. You have, you went full attack mode on our women, which that that pretty much destroys the nation. OK, because if you destroy if, if it's a chain and you destroy one link in that chain, what what happens? That chain is pretty much destroyed. All right. There's no there's no protection there. That chain does it doesn't do its job anymore, and that's exactly what has happened. You have turned our people into into what you would call niggas, okay? They're in they're in these 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 prison these prison houses, and these were all the curses of Yah Basham Al Shai that was going to come upon us. We were going to be impoverished, right? So these were all the curses. Now the Lord He's taking all these curses up off of us, and He's starting to put them on you, damn devils. And that opioid epidemic is just one, it's just one uh, part of the puzzle. One piece of the puzzle, okay? Or you have you your 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 uh your nation is full of homosexuals, okay? Or a lot of you, a lot of you Edomites, you're losing businesses, are right, killing yourselves, okay? You're losing your four hundred one k. Your woman is stepping out and going with a with a with a so called black man, okay? Uh, uh giving children to to give um birthing so called black children, okay? That's a that's a stain unto your name, man. That's a stain unto you being an Edomite. These other nations are starting to come up above you and technology wise, ec economics wise. OK, so here. So here's here because now that the, why is the Lord? He's putting all these curses upon upon you. OK, let me get a uh, let me get this scripture. All right, because you took you took the Bible. See, once you took the Bible and said that you're a, that you're an Israelite and that you're the God's you're God's fearing people and that you're a Christian, you pretty much sealed the deal, man. All right, you you sealed the deal. Now that you're a Christian, you say you're a Christian, but you don't follow any Christian ways. Okay, the the scriptures say you're not supposed to remove the uh the landmark, okay, of your neighbor, the ancient landmark. You have done that. The the, the scriptures say that you're not supposed to steal. You done that. You stole this land, okay. You stole our heritage. The scriptures say that you're not supposed to murder. You murder mil you murder uh um hundreds of millions of our people, okay. So you have broken every law, statute, commandment in this book. OK, you so-called white people and you do it today. You 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 propagate um, and push homosexuality. OK, that's totally against all the laws of the scriptures. You push men shaving their heads, shaving their beards. OK, you push a woman leaving her, her husband. OK, be uh, being a harlot in the city when there's certain repercussions that have to be placed in place. All right. If those things happen. And, and that and a lot of death is supposed to happen. A lot of people are supposed to get put to death because of their transgressions against the law. So now Esau, that you have taken the Bible, you said that you're a Christian. You say that you're a Jew. You practice Judo uh, Christianic uh, Christianic laws. Okay. You love God. You love Jesus. Well, now since now since you have taken that covenant upon you, right? You you said you're the Israelites. Now you have to you have to uh, you have to pretty much now you have to face. Those curses that are going to come upon you for actually saying that you're going to do something and you don't do it. OK, you're saying that you're going to worship the worship God, that you love God when well, you're doing everything totally opposite. So now your economy is crumbling. Now your power structure that uh, the Edomite, the Edomite uh, hegemony is, is waning, is getting destroyed as you speak. OK, so this is uh, Psalms 15 and 16. But unto the wicked, the most I saith. What thou ha what has thou to do to declare my statutes? So what are you doing, Esau, to say that you're a Christian? To say that you're a Jew? You're you're the wicked of the, you're the wicked that the Bible talks about. Okay? You're the perverse people and the forward people and the crooked people that the Bible talks about. But you're saying you're saying that you're a, you're God's chosen people. Now that you're saying you're God's chosen people, you have to do what's in that book and you have not done what that what's in the book. You have done everything totally opposite or that thou shouldest take my covenant into thy mouth. You're saying that 
the covenant was given unto you. Okay. Now, if that covenant was given unto you, that means you got to do whatever the covenant tells you to do. And you have not done that. All right. Verse 17. Seeing thou hatest instruction and cast of my words behind thee. That's right. You you cast the words of Yahweh Bashanah Shia behind you. The words in the Bible. Okay. The law, statutes, and commandments. Okay. Sir, there's ways that you have to govern the, the planet Earth. There's ways that you have to deal with your neighbor. There's ways that you have to deal with a woman. Okay. And there's and there's and there's laws that you have to um, exact if somebody goes off in the law. You said this is a a, a Bible fearing um, country. Okay. This nation was founded on Christianic beliefs. Okay. Ronald Reagan said in the 80s that this this the, the Bible was uh, the law of the land. Well, you take the Bible, all right, and all the laws that are written in the Bible about how a woman is not supposed to put on the clothes of a man. A man's not supposed to put on the clothes of a woman. Uh, you're not supposed to uh, defile yourself, okay? You're not supposed to, you're, there's certain foods that you got to eat. There's certain, there's certain ways that you have to till the ground. There's certain ways that you have to treat animals, okay? There's certain ways that you have to, uh, when you build a home, you build a house, when you establish, when you establish. Everything that you do, you do contrary to the scriptures. Okay, so now that you have taken upon the, the covenant, now that you have taken upon the laws that you're, that you're, that you're a God-fearing people, okay, now you have, to, you have to take upon those consequences that come according to the book. There's curses written in this book, okay? This, is, this book is a very spiritual book, all right? So this is, this is I'm going to go uh, to Deuteronomy 28 and 15. But, but it shall come to pass, if thou wilt not hearken unto the voice of the Lord thy power, Esau, since you said you're the God's chosen people, which we know that you're not. You're the wicked. But you took the book and said that you're a Christian. You got all these mega churches set up. Okay, you got a goddamn Edomite saying that they're Christians. You, you so-called white people. Okay, so now that since you didn't want to hearken unto the voice of the Lord thy power, okay, to observe and to all do all his commandments and his statutes which I command thee this day. This was given unto us. And we did not do that. We did not do that as a people. We went off. We said that we were going to do. We said that we we're going to follow our Lord. We said that we were going to um, do all the commandments that are in the book. And we didn't do that. And then look what the Lord has done to us. He put you under. He put us under you. And allowed you to, 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 to pretty much have your way with us. To make sport with us. Now what's happening is. Now, those curses are being placed upon you now, all right, because now the elect are rising up and they're following the law, statute, commandments, okay? So the Lord, he's well pleased with that. And now those, those, those curses that I'm going to start reading, they're falling upon you. Verse 16, okay, uh, I'm going to go back to 15. Uh, which I command thee this day, all these curses shall come upon thee and overtake thee. And we're seeing that these curses are overtaking you. Okay, and that ultimate curse is going to be when the nuclear missiles are shot off. Okay, and the, and the Lord comes with them chariots. Curse sh shalt thou be in a city, and curse sh thou shalt be in a field. Yeah, that's right. When you're in a city, you see Edomite, poor Edomites begging. Okay, arm chopped off of Vietnam War or the Desert War. Okay, they're all strung out on opioids. Okay, you got uh, Edomites, uh, as massive amount of Edomites as homosexuals. Okay, homeless. Cursed thou shalt be in the field, okay? You, you eat a mice, your, 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 uh, your, pretty much your businesses are pretty much through, okay? You're, you're, you're losing power to these other nations. So all these different, um, all these different businesses and all these different, um, things that you were once into, now, now you're losing, you're losing that power, you're losing that strength. Cursed thou shalt be in thy basket, in thy store. Yeah, these businesses that you have. Everywhere Esau goes, you're going to be cursed. Okay? Your stores are being exposed for selling fake food, for selling, selling GMOs. A lot of you Edomites, you're, you're losing to these other nations coming over, taking, taking, taking the profit. Okay? Okay, a lot of these, a lot of these uh, Kmart is shutting down. Sears is shutting down. Okay? Uh, a, a lot of these uh, Radio Shack. Why? Because of the goddamn Chinese. With the with the technology, are right, they're they're able to offer it at a, at a lower price? So you had once these big uh big American American uh, uh uh corporations that were like they were that that they were no, that America was known for. Now they they are they are crumbling because that's the curse. 
Cursed shall thou be the fruit of thy body. All right, you Edomites coming out all deformed. A lot of you women can't, a lot of you Edomite women can't have children. Your womb is closed. Okay, that's a curse to actually, a woman not to be able to bear children, that's a curse. And the fruit of the land, all right, the, the, uh, the, pretty much the, the, the produce of the land, the fruits and vegetables, okay, it's, they're cursed. That's why you have to make GMOs because the, the land will not yield its increase going back into, uh, going back into eight, the Cain, the curse of Cain. One of the, one of those curses is that the, the earth, that the earth was not going to give you its, in its increase to you. All right. Because you, cause you're, you're the damn devil. And the increase of thy kind and the flocks of thy sheep. So you're going to be cursed on every side, man. All right. Edomites are waning. Pretty much Edomites, uh, they're not, you're, they're not having children. They're pretty much being bred out. They're going to, there's, they say within the next, I forget decade or so that you damn, you damn white people. If America was to last, that you will be the minority. And you see that cause you, cause what majority of you, um, you Edomites are homosexuals. Okay. And curse, and curse, the flock of thy sheep. Yeah, you, uh, you, you're supposed to, you're supposed to prosper. This land was supposed to be a great land, and a prosperous land. But this land is not a great and prosperous land because you have destroyed the ecosystem. So now, when you have your your sheep, your this record, this represents your flocks. Well, that's money. To have sheep, to have cattle, to have bullock. Okay, your farms, your farms are being destroyed. OK, because you practice you 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 practice ill uh, business. Uh, um, you practice ill business. OK, the way that you treat these animals. OK, you have to you have to give art. You have to uh, use artificial insemination for these animals to even increase. OK, that's a curse unto you. You're you're if you have sheep, if you have lambs. OK, if you have goat, they're supposed to multiply. OK, but you're feeding them wrong foods. OK, so now you're being cursed. All right. And now a lot of that food, a lot of those uh, those uh, animals, they have to be imported now from China, from Brazil, from New Zealand, because you are you are cursed as a people. Why? Because you have taken uh, the, the book. All right. The, the Holy Bible and said that you're that you're the Christians, that the, you're the Jews, that you're God's chosen people. But then you don't follow none of the laws. Cursed shall thou be when thou comest in, and cursed shall thou be when thou goest out. Okay? Yeah, you got a lot of Edomites now due to this, this opioid epidemic. They they're, uh, they got to go to foster care, man. And then the, the children, they're addicted to opioids, man. They're addicted to the different drugs. Just like when our, 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 our children back in the 80s, the crack, the crack, uh, the crack epidemic, our, 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 the babies were born crack babies. Now, you, you Edomites are being born opioid babies. OK. So even your own have even your own Edomite, uh, um, your own Edomite people, they don't give a goddamn about you because now they have no control over this. Because now the Lord, since since we're waking up as a people, the Lord, he's cursing your ass. So curse when you come, when you're born into this place or you're getting you're getting shot up with uh, with these vaccinations, you're getting autism. OK, your, 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 your Edomite kids have to now they have to take uh, different medicines. OK, just to be normal because they're all hyperactive. OK, they have learning disabilities. OK. And I know I'm around these damn devils. I'm around these these parents that tell me if their kids are all messed up. One of my clients telling me that their kid, she doesn't know what to do. Her kid just bite goes around biting, biting kids, man, at school. Like a two year old in preschool. Now she got to hire outside help. Or she goes, she has to stop her job to go to te teacher conference parents, teacher parents conferences. OK, and have other uh, families yell at her, man, and curse her out. She's all bugged out. Her husband doesn't know. And this is Edomites, man. Goddamn Edomites. So now they're, now they're being cursed out. So curse when thou comest in and curse shall thou be when thou goes out because you're getting put to death at an all time high. Are you dying of over drug overdoses? You're dying of these different diseases due, due to your uh, the lack of nutrition, due to all these damn GMOs. OK. All right, you can't control your, your children. Okay, your, your daughter is going out with black and Hispanic men, Native American men. Your son is a becoming a homosexual. Okay, that's a curse unto you, man. The Lord shall send cursings 
vexings and rebuke and all that thou settest thy hand to do unto, uh, unto, the, unto for to do until thou be destroyed and thou perish quickly because of the wickedness of thy doings whereby thou hast forsaken me. All right, but this this was going to our people, but now it's this these all these curses according to according to Deuteronomy the thirtieth chapter the seventh verse, all the curses that were placed upon us. Now the Lord He's putting on our enemies, man, and our main enemy being these so-called white people, man. Okay, the Lord sitting cursings and vexings and rebuke, man. All right, all all your the skirt of the so-called white man is being lifted up, lifted up. All right, and you're being destroyed. Okay, quickly. It says, until thou perish quickly. And you see that, man. You see Esau, man, he's he's done, man. He's on a, he's on the brink of just destroying himself. Committing suicide. And a lot of you Edomites commit suicide, man. All right, because you were touched by your father when you were young. Here it is. Daughter, your, the daughter. The daughter was being molested by the father, man. That's how that's what goes down in these Edomite families, man. Okay? The 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 the, the, son, the, the son being molested, the son that's sleeping with the uh with the family dog, okay, with the sister. This shit happens in these Edomite um, family. Now it's being uncovered. Now all your wickedness, the skirt is, the Lord has lifted up your skirt and he's making known all the, the curses now unto all the nations. Okay, primarily to the nation of Israel now. Okay, the Lord shall make thee a pest, the Lord shall make pestilence cleave unto thee until thou hast consumed thee from the, off the land. Whether thou goest to possess it. So you damn Edomites, you're, you have all these different diseases. Okay? The different flesh-eating diseases. Uh, 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 keloids. Okay? Hemorrhoids. HIV. AIDS. Okay? Diabetes. Okay? Hashimoto's disease. Okay? All these different autoimmune diseases. Sickle cell. Cancer. You, you Edomites are dying of all that, man. And the Lord shall smite thee with uh, consumption. And with a fever and with inflammation. Now, when you go into disease, all disease starts with inflammation. And how are you getting this inflammation? Because of your diet. All right. Eating all this damn pork, all that swine, all that lobster. All right. You eating GMOs. Okay. The, the food has pesticides and, and, um, and, and, um, and, uh, and, and the poisons in it. Okay. So now you, that was for the ch children of Israel to consume and destroy them. Okay. Which it did destroy us to a degree, but the Lord, he left a remnant. Okay, our people are still resilient. Now your body, your body is weaker than our body. So now all these curses are starting to come upon you. Now you got to, you got to shop where the same place where, uh, where Israelites shop at, where, where, where you would call Negroes, blacks. Okay, you got to eat fake, you got to eat, uh, fake processed cheese. You eat, you eat McDonald's, you drinking soda. Okay, and you're addicted to it. And with extreme burning. And with the sword, and with blasting, and with the mildew, and and they shall pursue thee until thou perish. So all these things are going to come upon you, okay? All these things are coming upon you, and you, that's why you're dying, okay? The cancer rate, the cancer rate in America is is, is higher than any other country, okay? This this the uh, 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 the the rate of people that die here from diseases, okay, are is number one, okay? The the obesity rate is America is number one, man. And there's a lot of, it's a lot of you goddamn so-called white people because you're addicted to that fast food and that fast food was set up to destroy Israelites. But now you are being destroyed by that, man. You're being destroyed by the floor, fluoride, floor, fluoride water. You're being destroyed by the prescription drugs. Okay. You're being destroyed by that, that consumption and that fever. Or you, you might come down with, with, uh, with the, with the chicken pox and die or what, or, or with the fever, man. Or with the common cold and you'll die, man. Okay? Because because you have been told you're being cursed now. Okay? Or uh, your your womb is in, inflamed. Okay? You're having prostate issues. Okay? You have inflammation in your brain. Okay? You got to send your... You eat on my family's got to send your, your loved ones, your mothers and your fathers to these, these, uh, these elderly homes where they're being abused. Okay? And, the, and thy heaven that is over thy head shall be brass, and the earth that is under thy foot shall be iron. Yeah, your your comfortable position that you're here now, this 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 you it was given in, this earth was given unto you, but look, you destroyed it. Now the Lord He's destroying your ass. Okay, 
so you know i'm a uh i'm a i'm gonna end the video and then um you know lord's will i'm gonna do a part two to finish up where i left off but basically a hey, esau you all these curses are coming upon you now because you have taken the scriptures and you have said that you're the you're the ch you're the children of god and that you're gonna work that you're gonna follow these laws that's your commandments you say that you're doing it and you're not doing it so now the lord he's judging you for that man and good riddance for you damn devil so all the curses are coming upon our enemies man and it's a beautiful thing the water y'all bust your mouth shy for that, man. We're seeing you goddamn devil fall. Okay? So with that, all praise, honor, and glory to y'all bust your mouth shy. Double honors to the apostles and elders. Peace and blessings to the Akim. Shalom.